my home projects are great for saving money and enjoying a good challenge. For these household projects are better left for professional, it can be helpless feeling. When the kitchen sink won't trend, with water backing up a counter full of dirty dishes waiting to be cleaned. It may be tempting to reach for the phone and tell the plumber. Before you do read these easy to it yourself ways to unlock the trend. Boiling water, this is the easiest and least expensive solution of all. Which makes it the best one to try first. Place a kettle or pot of water on the stove and bring to a rolling boil. While you're waiting for the water to heat, remove as much as standing water from the sink. As you can using a mug or a small pot to boil out the water. Then pour the entire kettle of water into the sink and wait. If the water stands in the sink and the clock does not move. Give the water time to cool and remove it to try again. You may need to repeat the process several times to move the clock. But this often works on many types of stoppage. The disposal check to make sure it's not your carpet disposal that's causing the problem. A clock disposal can stop up the train so run the disposal to see if that clears the clock. Then inspect it to make sure it's running correctly. If the disposal has overheated, you may need to flip the switch found on the side or bottom of the unit underneath the sink. Salt and piling water after removing standing water from the sink. Pour about one and a half cup of table salt down the drown before you pour in the boiling water. Let it sit for a few minutes and then flush with hot water to clear the mixture. Vinegar and baking soda I can remove standing water first. Pour about a cup or so of baking soda into the train. Followed by an equal amount of white or apple cider vinegar. The solution will bubble but when they subside put the stopper in and out about 15 minutes. Next run hot water to see if the clock clears. Repeat if needed. Plunger if these combinations are not successful in unclogging your sink, reach for a common household plunger. If you have a double sink, for seal of the second side with a wet cloth or a stopper. You'll need to create a tight seal around the plunger. So fill the side of the sink you intend to plunk with enough water to cover the pail of the plunger. Place the plunger firmly over the drain and plunk vigorously several times. When you hear the suction clear the cloak, remove the plunger and flush the train well with warm water.